So yeah, this is um, we're not gonna do a lot of vlogs, uh, but we thought we'd do one here because we've come today to the War and Peace Show in Kent, uh, biggest uh, military fair thing in Europe. There's gonna be guns, there's gonna be military vehicles, there's gonna be loads of stuff, so uh, let's take a look. This one's the 44 Magnum, it's not even, it's the 44 Magnum, it's not even a 50 Auto Express. So, this one's three grand, so does that mean it's a 50 Auto Express? Yes, it's nice though. This is my, this is my favourite, the Integrally Suppressed, but that's not, really is that real? No, it's all locked up so tight. FAL? FAL? Yep. Unfortunately, the laws in this country mean that this is locked tighter than a nun's. Yeah, so it's not even attached. It's not even attached to a bolt anymore. It's a shame, but yeah. Oh, and already we have the Taurus Raging Bull. Raging Bull. Yeah, 44 Magnum. So this is Smith and Wesson 44 Magnum. This one opens, but you can see how much damage they do to uh, deactivate these things. Yeah. Uh, got a Wolfer, one of the PPKs, but not the S. I prefer the S. Uh, this one should, st no, even this one doesn't stay open. What's going on? Well, uh, they've changed everything, haven't they? Yeah, 1911, but this is, uh, this is another, but this is not Colt. This is someone else, DGFM. I mean, the licensing for the 1911 has been put out to so many people over the years. Oh, Badger! They have one of my favourite guns. Wolf P99. 750 quid though. <laughs> A bit out of my price. I, I love these pistols. I don't know why. It's just, it's just the... Sh Ooh. Okay. Let's start from scratch. See why this won't do anything. No, 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 it's not the, no, no, it's not the slide release. There's something, so decocking, no. Maybe it's part of the deactivation process for this particular pistol. That's a shame, that is. Glocks, Glock 19, Glock 19, that might be a Glock 19. Yes! Have the regulations changed on the way they deactivate? Yeah. Oh, they have? Ah, right. Yes. Check it out. Ooh, that's heavy. Ugh. I like the sounds. <laughs> pew pew. That is heavy. <laughs> that is really heavy. Right, so uh, we've come to one of the things that we wanted to do today. Uh, have a little competition behind us. Well, 22 long rifle uh, target range. We're not going to go for accuracy as in bullseye because it's a public thing. There's, the sights are going to be all over the place. We're going to go for a grouping contest. I'll wear the head cam whilst we're shooting and uh, we'll see who comes out on top. If you think you can take a guess, pause the video and leave a comment below and see if you can guess who's going to win out of the two of us. So we're going to 
see who did the best. So again, we're going to do in groupings, we're not going for bullseye. So, oh, yes. there's my one. Where's yours? No, oh, I think I win. Yeah, you win. Yeah, you buy the next round of drinks. Fair enough. But now we're going to go and harass people on the bump cars and jump off of something. <laughs> No! Stop! Ah! Ha 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 Beer, 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 beer. That's the end of our first vlog. Uh, I'm not promising there'll be more, but we just came out and had a bit of fun. If you happen to be uh, in Kent in the uh, end of July, I definitely recommend checking out Warren Beach Show. It's now pissing it with rain. Um, but yeah, we had a laugh. So uh, yeah. So yeah, please subscribe, like, hit, you know, check us out on all the social media. And uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Bye, folks. See ya.